Hey adventurers, I'm Bruno Revlin and welcome back to another hotel review. Today we will be reviewing the Hilton San Diego Gas Lamp Quarter, which is a hotel located in San Diego. It is a very good hotel with a very affordable price. Well, for our room we picked a simple room, but yet very spacious and comfortable room. We only paid $149 per night. Sorry for the messy room, but we filmed it one day after we arrived. But anyways, the room was amazing. I would rate it a 5 out of 5 stars for the price and location. The bathroom was very simple, but it sure met all the expectations needed. It had enough space and everything worked perfectly. The wardrobe was quite nice as well. It had enough space for what we needed and the safe worked perfectly. Well, now adventurers, I'm gonna invite you all to come downstairs with us so I can show you all the lobby. Starting at the bar, they also had a cafeteria slash restaurant inside the hotel together with a lobby. They had a nice rating room with a fire heater to make it cozy. And towards the front, they had all these bunny statues to commemorate the 150th anniversary for the setting off San Diego's new town. Also, they have a small area to give the dogs some water. They also write the name of the dogs that are staying in the hotel at the moment. The second floor is also an waiting slash chill area, but it also gives you access to the pool, in which I'm gonna show you later in a little bit. Here is the reception and right next to it we have a little area that you can connect to the internet and use the computers if you need to. And right next to that area we have a small marketplace which is open 24 hours from the hotel. It's just a little room with foods and drinks that you can purchase. Outside there is a sign indicating the restaurant inside the hotel which is the New Leaf restaurant. And since we are outside, I must say, there are many amazing places around and everywhere around the hotel. It's quite beautiful. Together with the hotel, we have some other restaurants and steakhouses serving also seafood. If you need access from the outside, there is also a doorway that unlocks with the key. They also have a spa called Artasia and the outside of the second floor is also a place that you can chill. There's not much to do there. There are some uh, stories on the walls regarding the history of San Diego's port, I believe. If you guys want to pause and read it, feel free to do so. And finally, last but not least, we have the pool area. The pool area is amazing. They have an indoor gym if you feel like working out. And the pool itself, it's quite big. You also have some amazing views and you will be definitely able to chill out there for the whole day if you need to. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this review. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share it with your friends. I thank you all and I'll see you on the next hotel review.